Here we go, round one, Harry Hardwick versus Luke Westwood. Jay, both these guys, two and all, equally matched in skill and in record. Yeah, perfect matchup on paper. You can see the uh, the physical matchup as well should make for an interesting fight. You've got the taller fighter in Hardwick taking on Westwood. A bit shorter, a little bit more compact. Obviously, that has its own uh, stylistic problems for both guys. Westwood throwing the big right hands early on. Nice leg kick there by Hardwick. Yeah, Westwood looking to counter that low kick with a right hand. Just missed its mark. Good camps for both guys as well. The dungeon and uh, Middlesbrough Fight Academy. Good to see both these guys taking on tough fights, evenly matched fights at this point in their uh, amateur careers. Yeah, Westwood, beautiful head movement there, Jay. Really nice. Yeah, stepping in on his shots there a little bit, telegraphing him a little bit. He's not really hitting the shots, but he landed a nice low kick on the end there. Goes nice. for the single, gets it. Yeah, he couldn't quite get that single Hardwick. He was savvy to it. Coming from, uh, obviously, a good wrestling gym, you see Abdul Mohammed in his corner there. So, certainly be well versed in his wrestling game. A dungeon known as uh, a BJJ gym primarily. Westwood's doing really well with the hands. The only problem I've got is he's backing off a little bit too much and he's, he's putting himself out of range with them shots. When he's attacking, hot. Big right hand. Oh, do you to say when he's attacking, he's just slightly short by an inch or two. Oh, lovely takedown trip, but Harwick let him straight back up on his feet. And he got hit with a counter there. Good pace from both of these fighters so far. It's a little bit more Westwood, landing a few more shots and uh, being a little bit more aggressive, but Hardwick still moving forward. I'd like to see him a little bit more assertive with his jab and his hands. Nice straight shots to keep the shorter man at bay, but he's not really using his length much. I think what's giving Hardwick a saving grace right now is he's just out of reach of Westwood's hands. Westwood, when he's throwing them, like I say, he's about an inch or two, just, just short. Both guys uh, stringing together nice combinations of shots, but as you say, it, it's making them shots hit the mark. Grabs that single again, he's not going to get it. You could tell that wasn't going to go. Yeah, Hardwick very confident in his, uh, in his takedown defence there. Two times he's shot for that same single leg, and two times Oh, that's a it. bit better. The one-two connected that time. Yeah, a bit of confidence in the hands there at Westwood. Maybe it'll just take him a couple of minutes to get into this fight, get into this round. There's the 10 second knock. Especially if you're fighting a guy at that, that tall who's got that kind of range. You just gotta find your mark a little bit. And Westwood seems to have found it coming towards the end of the round. Exactly, Jay. I think coming into the next round, I think his distance is just getting on target now. Here we go, round two. Has Westwood found his mark? Needs to gauge that distance, that was better, nice right hand. Yeah, he slipped well, nice little slip and he countered with the right hand, that was a, a nice shot there from uh, from Westwood. It's Hardwick who's doing all the pressing, who keeps moving forward. Totally agree. Nice counter job there from Westwood. Spinning back kick. And he drives nice one, a drive, big Nice beautiful. Leg. Power double straight to the opposite side of the cage. First time this fight's gone to the ground. What does Westwood have on top? Yeah, and that literally went from one side of the cage to the other. Westwood just trying to control the position, trying to solidify this, uh, this position here so he can get that top game going. Sits inside the half guard. You know, sometimes the long limb guys can be tricky from the bottom. He stands up. Oh, and he lets his work. man up there. Nice work by Hard. We're getting back to his feet. I think Westwood will be quite comfortable to have this back on the feet, though. He's scored the points. Nice knee to the body there. I think that actually hurt Westwood a little bit. Tries to punch his way out of the clinch. Again, some nice takedown defense from uh, Hardwick. Despite having them long limbs, Westwood can get a hold of him, but he's finding it really hard to finish those single legs. Oh, nice body good. shot, beautiful work. Yeah, nice roll there, it does roll well. Yeah, I said in the first round his head movement was great. Oh, beautiful front kick straight to the face there of Westwood. 
That's where you can start to use your range well. Long kicks and nice straight punches. Yeah, the hands of Hardwick are not really flying, are they? they? He seems to be taking his time. He's letting Westwood tee off first. Yeah, whilst he is doing most of the forward motion, he's not really throwing shots when he goes, and he's getting countered quite a lot. Nice left hand lands there on the break from the clinch. But constant work by Westwood gets his man down again. Finally gets that success with a single leg. Let's see if he can land some more damage from the top this time. Wasn't really able to solidify his position the first time. Well, Hardwick hasn't got the cage to press against and stand back up this time in the centre of the cage. But like you say, Jay, the long legs, the long limbs of Hardwick. Oh, beautiful strike. Yeah, just as uh, Hardwick was thinking about the grappling game and a big right hand came through, right on the button. That's the difference between ground grappling in the gym and this MMA game, but a nice push off there to create some space. And he counters out of that clinch with some nice punches there, Hardwick. He's looking to be a little bit more aggressive to end the round. Beautiful, a lot, lot more work ethic there from both guys in the second round. But the man I give the handwork to was definitely Westwood. Hardwick's been throwing the hands, but not really catching with it. it, it his power doesn't seem as strong as Westwood. Well, here we go, third and final round. Show of appreciation, sportsmanship. But Westwood, in my eyes, just slightly up on the scorecard. Looking to land that big right hand again is Westwood. Nice low kicks from uh, Hardwick. They've taken their toll on the, the thigh of Westwood, you can tell. You can see the marks. Goes with a kick to the body. The only thing what's letting Westwood down right now is he, he, he keeps backing off all the time. He's got good hands, great head movement. Just doesn't look good that he backs off at every single time that Hardwick steps forward. That's it. That's what we want to say. That's better hands. Yeah, stepping in with them shots. And when you step in with them shots moving forward, when they do land, they're going to have a, uh, more of an effect as well. I mean, Hardwick, he, he still looks like he's trying for stuff. As you see there, he's throwing his hands, throwing the kicks, looking for knees. He's having more success thus far in the third round. Oh, oh big right of a good. Westward, uh, Westward working nicely on the inside. Best shot of the match. And another good shot there from Westwood. Hardwick doesn't seem phased, he's got a good chin. Working with the body as well, just missed. Great boxing skills there from Luke Westwood. A good left hand came through there from Hardwick. But just not landing enough of his shots. The no, output's there, but the accuracy is just, just off the mark, I think. I think Hardwick needs to do something different. You know, he's fighting the same game from round one to round three, and he's, he's slightly losing. Oh, another left hook. Hardwick has had some success with the, the front kicks. Uh, every time he's thrown them, maybe that could be an idea. I think he's going to need a finish at this point in the exactly, fight. Exactly, he's not winning with a hand, so he may as well take him down, try something on the ground, but he's quite happy to just stand there. Nice Westwood shot. looking for that takedown. He gets it. Only just Hardwick back to his feet. Pushing his man on the fence. Good head position for Westwood. And Westwood will be more than content to uh, ride this round out from this position. Yeah, Westwood just in total control now. All of the knees from Hardwick are coming in. It's Hardwick that has his back against the cage. Like I said, Westwood would be quite happy to ride this round out. And you can hear Hardwick's corner. They're telling him to just go for anything that he can. Look for the finish. There's 10 seconds left and he just needs to go for broke now. But great control from Westwood and it looks like he's going to see this fight out. And there we have it. Just on the bell. We get a takedown from Hardwick, but it will not count. It was after the bell. Great match. Equally matched, but one of these guys will lose their undefeated record.